G'day everyone! So, while we wait for Season 2 of Metal Cardboard to completely release outside of Korea, I have been experimenting with a bit of 3D printing. So far I have only made a very sad looking laser beak and some very prototype weapons for Biurfa and Baimie. However, with the recent discovery of Metal Cardbot, I figured that I could try to recreate one of the metal card weapons that are used throughout the show. And who better to test this with than Dexter, who you may remember having his iconic yellow drill that could tunnel through just about anything. Also, he's one of my favourite characters, so of course I would choose him first. So this here is Dexter's drill, and now here is my Dexter's drill. It's still a prototype that hasn't even been painted yet, but I really like it. Especially since it can actually spin like a drill. Although, don't expect to be drilling much with this tool. So, my wiring is kinda messy, but straightforward, using only a battery, a push button, a motor and a plastic tire rim, allowing me to perform his iconic spiral ray to my heart's content. Spiral ray! In addition, I have tried to somewhat incorporate its card form by having the sides and top fold over, but getting it to fold like the show would require a fair bit of rework. But hey, at least I can have it stand like a mini drill crab. So it's far from perfect and there are a lot of things that I would still like to change, like the mounting of the handle through the wrist, as well as making the handle easy to hold, filling in these empty spaces and don't get me started on my wiring. But for the purposes of this prototype, I think it looks pretty cool and proportion wise it's pretty close to Dexter's in the show, as initially it went from this little cone all the way up to the current drill you see here. Nevertheless, that's all I really wanted to show you all. I might tinker with this a little bit later down the line, but I think I'll take a little respite from the drill prototype and come back to it a little later. But if you were interested in the parts and models, let me know, and I might find a way to upload the model components to print yourself, or for you to even improve upon them, as it would be really cool to see everyone's interpretations and designs. Regardless, I really hope you enjoyed this slightly different video. I have had a bit of a creativity spark into 3D printing recently, as I may or may not be working on something else regarding a little red car, but I'll show you that a bit later down the track. I also want to try making Dexter's head as a full-on helmet, but at the moment I'm using Fusion, which isn't exactly the greatest for curvy objects. I don't know whether I'll keep making more or switch to making something different, as I have a bad habit of starting something and never finishing it, but we'll see if I can change that. But until next time, bye bye.